Let's move on to the next one, which says, so question three, which book or web pages or resources do you recommend to learn all about ethical hacking and penetration testing? So I feel like um, we kind of answered or we kind of touched upon this question in previous, uh, in in the first or in the second episode, but we could reemphasize some of the main uh, some of the main points uh, uh, from from then. What do you say, Alexis? So, um, yeah. So the, this this question is is quite broad in regards to what it's asking for because there's, there's tons of resources. All I can do is simply just point you uh, in the direction of a great starting point, and then you know you can sort of build uh, you can build up from there. So. Starting off with books, which was the first question, uh, I always recommend the Hacker Playbook. If 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 you're a beginner and you're looking for uh, you know an entry point, that's by Peter Kim, right? Yes, yes. So it's it's typically the the entire collection. I think is that the third version was also released released uh, I think last year. I'm not too sure, uh, but the, those, are, yeah. those are excellent books, right? And uh, they, they, they sort of give you a starting point into pen testing. Uh, the second one that I feel is like a must have is like the red team field manual um, that primarily like has all the the important and useful commands that uh, well not commands but just nifty tips and tricks that you'll find extremely useful when uh, when when performing a pen test so uh, that, that, that's the second one um, I would also say uh, the the other one was uh, I can't remember the author um, but it's, it's a fantastic book and it's actually one of the recommended readings for pen testers. It's, uh, I think it's called the, it's called penetration testing, uh, the hands-on introduction to hacking or something like that. Uh, it, it's quite an old book at this point, And I believe there is a second version being worked on, but that pretty much covers like everything you could, you could possibly be interested in regards. Uh, regards I don't think I know that one. Uh, it, it, it's an excellent book. And, and the reason I recommend it is because, again, as I said, it covers like every every stage of the pen test and breaks everything down so that you can understand it. And, of course, the final one I recommend, and it's one of my personal favorites, is uh, I think it's Hacking the Art of Exploitation. And it, it really isn't related to pen testing per se, but it, it's it's an excellent book in, in regards to, you know, working with exploits and stuff, like writing your own exploits as well. So very useful, uh, something that you might want to check out later on once you've, uh, you're, you're, you're a bit more competent in, at what you're doing. Um, in regards to websites, I think, in my opinion, the greatest starting point is obviously going to be uh, Cybrary because they have uh, quite a few free courses. Uh, and it, it, I think it's a fantastic resource for the community. Uh, truly, truly great resource. Um, that's pretty much where I would you know, push anyone who's looking for a starting point. Uh, when talking about uh, actual labs and um, and practicing your uh, your skills, there, there's tons of sites, as you know, we've talked about Hack the Box, Volnub. Uh, there are a few others. Uh, so for example, we have Pentester Lab. Um, we also have Attack Defense and Pentester Academy, which are, uh, I think are also high up there, but of course they require a subscription of, of sorts. So for those of you who are interested in taking that route and having an, an active subscription to these services, they're truly excellent services. Uh, but for a free resource, all I can say is that Cyber is the best. And of course, uh, the, the books that I've mentioned can, sample, can supplement that, but uh, you will find additional resources as you move along. So that's pretty much all, 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 all that I have to say and the resources that I think are the best. Fellas, check out my Python Basics course to learn the fundamentals of Python you need in cybersecurity. There's a discount link in the description. Awesome. Okay, so uh, we'll link to all of these uh, resources in the description of this video. Uh, what I want to add here, so uh, aside of these amazing resources, I would say that uh, in terms of books, one of my... Uh, like reference books, which is still, I mean, it's a book from 2011. It's uh, the Web Application Hacker's Handbook uh, by Defeat Stuttered. Yeah. Um, that even though it's like an older book, uh, it still pretty much applies to a lot of um, 
to a lot of the methodologies and a lot of uh, the practical stuff that's going on today uh, in terms of pen, pen testing web applications. So yeah, Web App Hacker's Handbook. And I might have a few other titles, but uh, those would be more like for uh, bug bounty hunting, but the question asks uh, ethical hacking and penetration testing. So I don't know, maybe we'll approach bug bounty hunting in another um, episode. In terms, of, uh, in terms of library, in terms of um, uh, web resources, uh, Cybery, uh, yes, it's one of the, the best out there uh, because they have a lot of stuff for free. Back, uh, like a year ago, uh, everything on Cyberry, I believe, was free. Uh, but I, I think at the beginning of 2019, they started adding some uh, paid content or content behind a subscription. They're inside their pro subscription, which is like $100 a month. I've actually tested it out, and I have to say that it's really good. They have a lot of practice labs with real world scenarios, which is what I like. I don't like CTF like stuff. Uh, they have a lot of real world scenarios from different providers. So if you go, for example, on uh, Hack the Box, um, all, the, all the boxes there are made uh, like in a similar way. So you have a box, a Linux box or a Windows box, you have to get a flag and stuff like that. But the... Um, the practice labs on Cybery, let's say on a topic, for example, SQL injection, you have uh, you have the lab uh, you have labs from multiple providers giving you different types of approaches towards exploiting SQL injection, and that's uh, that's really important because you learn from a multi perspective, and that, in my view, is of course better. So Cybery is the good way to go. I mean, they don't have free labs from what I know, but they have free courses. One of the good courses, I believe it's still free, is uh, Georgia Whitman's Advanced Pen Testing. That would be a good start. Even though it, it says Advanced Pen Testing, I'm not really sure if it's advanced. It's, it's one of the first uh, courses from what I know on Cybery. Um, and... Also, from what I know, Georgia is working, maybe she, look, so I, I think um, she's, I know she's working on the second um, edition of her book, and I believe she's also working, uh, hope I'm not wrong, she's also working on the second edition of, of the, the course. So that course by Georgia Weedman on Cybery and also the course by Ken Underhill uh, on uh, penetration testing. Yeah. Um, those are two good ones to start. She's actually the, the author of, of the book that I just mentioned, uh, Hands-On Introduction. Oh, Hacking. yeah, right. Of yeah, course. So, this so she, is, I don't know why I thought, I mean, it, it didn't ring a bell when you, when you said the title, but... Uh, yeah, you'll yeah, learn so, you, you know from, from, from the cover. Yeah, so we'll actually link to, to Georgia's book in the description and hopefully she's going to release the second edition soon. Yeah. Uh, so in terms of another platform, that would be Attack Defense Labs. You mentioned it, Alexis. Uh, uh, I'm not sure how much you've practiced on, on Attack Defense Labs. I've practiced a little and I've done quite a few videos on Attack Defense. I think, I think they have a lot of potential. Right now, their subscription is around like 35 to 40 dollars a month which i would say is worth it it's definitely worth it because you have a lot of um, a lot of scenarios uh, and most of them are real world lifelike scenarios divided into like tons of uh, tons of categories stuff like network recon real world web apps traffic analysis metasploit offensive Python, cracking, infrastructure attacks, secure coding, reverse engineering, forensics, and I'm actually reading from their, their website uh, here. Malware analysis, exploit yeah. research, cloud security, a lot of good stuff. So um, I would say Attack Defense Labs would be worth a try. And maybe in, in another uh, episode, we're gonna do some of these challenges live with uh, yep with you guys.